Hi, I'm Elizabeth Steinglass. I'm the author of Soccerverse, poems about soccer, illustrated by Edson Ike. The book includes 22 poems about everything soccer related. Uh, the ball, uniforms, shin guards, red cards, teammates, coaches, positions, running, dribbling, everything you can think of. The poems use a variety of forms. Uh, you may have heard of forms like concrete poetry or haiku or poems of address or poems of apology. Those are all different forms. And this book includes poems with 13 different forms. All of them are described in the back of the book. So I thought I would read a few of the poems and then describe a couple of activities that you could do at home. Here's the first poem in the book, The Ball. The Ball. Round like the moon, sailing through space. Round like an eye, spotting just the right place. Perfect for trapping, tapping, and spinning. Perfect for kicking, bending, and winning. Scarred like a knee after a fall. Our feet find a world around this ball. Here's the poem, Uniform Day. Uniform Day. How about red? Red could have been right. Red like the eyes of a vampire at night that freeze you in fear before the first bite. Why, oh why, couldn't it be blue? Blue like a shark that knows what to do when there's blood up ahead that smells brand new. Even purple might have been okay. Purple like the bruise I earned that day when the striker struck and I got in the way. Anything would have been better than green. Green like a wobbly, soggy old bean. I don't want to look cooked. I want to look mean. And now here is a poem called a few words from your shin guard. Find me. I'm under the bed. Sure, I smell like something dead, but who cares? Wear me. Wear a pair of me. Tuck me in your sock and let's get out of here. I want to be kicked. It's why I exist. I'm the shining armor guarding your shin while you run down the field and go for the win. And because shin guards come in pairs, I thought shin guard poems should come in pairs. So here is a few words from your other shin guard. Look, I'm not there. I'm not under your bed. I'm not in your bag. I'm not on your desk. I'm here where you left me after the game, when you ran away when it started to rain. I'm here where you left me, next to the field, with an empty juice box and an old orange peel. And then here's a, here are a couple poems about different positions on the field. Here is one called Defender. You think I'm a dog asleep by the door, my ears hanging like the clothes sign at the ice cream store, my eyes twisted shut like the blinds in your room, my head in a dream world of rabbits. See my shiny nose grow wide, See my ears shift to the side. I know you're coming before you do. You're the rabbit I'm waiting for. And then here is one called Striker. And I don't know if I said it before, but these illustrations are done by Edson Ike, and I love them. I think they're wonderful. Striker. A shark slipping through the sea until she smells opportunity. She sets her course she sets her soul on one essential goal. Quick flick, she scores. And here's my favorite, teammates. We stretch together, we run together, we dribble together, we kick together. We attack together, we defend together, we cheer together, we groan together. Together we meet our fate. And here is one for the coaches. Pep talk. Sometimes when I'm frustrated, I feel like a bit of dust blowing across the field. Dust can't shoot with a weak foot or make a cross from the wing or break through a crowd with the ball. But when I hear you say, try again, I know you think I can and I become the wind. 
And here's the last poem in the collection. It's called Good Dreams. Sometimes at night I lie in bed and stick my feet up over my head. I toss my bear. I kick him quick, making a perfect bicycle kick. I watch bear fly, spinning in air, missing the bar by one brown hair. Upside down, I settle the game. Thousands of fans sing my name. I fall asleep humming that song. I kick that kick the whole night long. So here are a couple of ideas for things that you can do at home. One of them is you can color um, your own kits. Um, pretend it's uniform day and you get to choose. Um, you, can, you can draw the kits for yourself, of course, but if you want this page, you can download it from my website at www.elizabethsteinglass.com and right on the home page, you'll see a little note and at the bottom of the note, there's a link to download this page. So you can think for yourself, um, you know, what colors do I want my uniform to be? Um, you could do a team that exists, you could do a made up team, you could give your team a name and a logo. Um, you can do home and away kits and training kits. Um, so that's one really fun thing that you can do at home. My second idea is for you to write a mask poem. Um, remember the shin guard poems I wrote? Those are called mask poems because I had to put on a mask of a shin guard, pretend to be a shin guard, and then imagine what a shin guard would wanna say, how a shin guard would feel, what a shin guard might think. So you choose something. Um, maybe you could choose a soccer ball. If you were a soccer ball, um, how would you feel? What would you think? Where would you be? Um, what would you be hoping? What would you be wishing for? So pretend to be the soccer ball, answer some of those questions and write a poem from that point of view for the, where the I is the soccer ball. Thanks for listening. Um, have a great day. Bye.